Hello everybody and welcome back to the Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark playthrough where we have the Jewel Mine. Hey kid, you gotta be careful here. There's a lot of strong Pokemon in there. Okay. Where we get to go find a Gemini. And hopefully catch it without many problems. That'd be great. Uh, let's go this way. It seems a little maze-like, so I think I'm just gonna do the whole, you know, stick your hand to the left wall and uh, keep walking. And eventually we'll get somewhere we need to go. Like, is this the way forward, or is this just a random side area? Who knows? Wait, I saw you on television. You're the new champion. Please battle me. Sure, why not? Siphoon. Yeah, not gonna be a double battle though. That's unfortunate. Guess it'd be a little cheap though. I wonder if we still get healed though. We probably do. Uh, what are you, rock type? Fleck, huh. Oh, Stone Edge. Not so great. Uh, I hope we get healed after this then. We probably do. Otherwise we'll just get into a wild battle and uh, beat that. And Christox. Rock Poison. Oh man, with the heightened defense, with Reflect. Uh, might be more worth it to switch. Yeah, let's switch to somebody else. Okay, eh, rock poison. Let's go Lunape. Oh, now Reflect fades, of course. We might get a level up on Lunape here, too. Yeah. The way you battled, there's no mistaking that you're indeed the champion. Yeah, you bet I am. It was an honor battling you and your Pokemon. Oh yeah, we do get healed. Okay. Well, that's not so bad. Uh... Okay, so that's the way out. So I think we're going the right way. This probably just kind of loops around a lot. Ooh, that was fast. Might make a save here just in case. I don't know. Cause who knows how fast it's gonna throw me into the battle. It'll probably let me save before the fight though. Most games are pretty good about doing that. Hold up, you can't go wandering in here without the proper equipment. Diamante. And another Christox, yay. Probably still bulky, yeah. Oh, and poisoned, lovely. I am so glad we have Rocco here to heal us. This place would be a pain otherwise. And you're gonna hit five times. Nope, four times, okay. Less bad. Yeah, let's just drain and kiss that, I guess. Actually, probably would have been better to use Crunch. Oh well. What else do you have? Leonite. Okay. 
Let's switch to somebody better for this. Like Fang. Because I'd rather not spend the next hour fighting random trainers. It'd be nice if we could get some more uh, legendaries going. At this rate, we're going to catch, like, what, one an episode? Maybe two? Uh, some of them are a little easier to get to, though. All the sh temple shrine ones, I mean, you just walk up and encounter those ones. Essentially. And Fang rolled up. You're no joke. No, I'm the champion. Quite the capable trainer. You should be... You should still be careful. Mines are known to be hazardous. What do you have to say? Ugh, break time can't come sooner. Sure, the sparkles of light from the jewels are nice, but I can't wait to get back outside and be under the sun. Well, I guess we have the flashlight, don't we? Have we used that already? Okay. Don't know if that's still saved or... Okay... I feel like we're about to go in one giant circle, which is great. Maybe not? This is a big area regardless. Wish the encounter rate wasn't one every three steps. Uh... That's a Leonite and a Jewel Tool. What's this way? Have we been this way? Yeah, we're definitely going in a circle now, aren't we? I think if we go left, we'll end up where we were. We'll try it, though. Gotta stick to our principles, you know? I said, I'm putting my left hand on the wall. We're gonna stick our left hand to the wall. Okay, we're gonna switch Vincent out of being in the front, just because the shiny animation adds a couple extra seconds, and it's lovely. Stop! I know you're with those thieves that ran by. Okay. Well, we're fighting a new trainer, so I guess we can't be going in too many circles. Uh, Glossus. Fighting type, right. I always think it's dark type. It's not dark type. It's part fighting. Uh, set free. Uh, let's see. Dark pulse. Easy. Alright. I may have misjudged. Yeah. Do I look evil? If you're looking for those thieves, please put a stop to them. Who knows what awful things they're planning. Uh, down. Oh, okay. I guess we're going the right way. Aw, oh, man. Boss, this place is like a maze. It's impossible. It's here somewhere. Just look at all the jewels on the wall. That Pokemon is definitely here. My feet hurt. Do you know how many times I've tripped over? Shut it, you two. Keep moving. It's here. I know it. I wonder who those guys were. They talked about jewels, so they might be looking for Gemini, too. We should keep an eye on them. Repel. Oh, how nice of you, Lunape. Well, I sure am glad we're going the right way, because I am lost, too. Okay. Uh, let's save here. Nope, okay, this still keeps going. What's down here? Anything? Nothing. The encounter rate has gone down? Possibly to nothing? Might just not be any encounters in this area? I think we're close. Gotta be boss. Have you figured out how you're gonna catch it? I mean, there's a lot more gems here. Of course I have you, Claude. I have a Master Ball. What? Can I have his Master Ball? Once I've caught it, I'll make it create many valuable jewels that I'll sell. I'll be rich. We will be rich. Yes. Uh, we. Uh-huh. You can't do this. And who are you? Hey, wait, I recognize those two. The short one is a member of the Elite Four, and the other one is the new champion. 
I don't care who you are. Get out of here. I won't let you catch Gemini and use it like that. Ha, huh, you won't let me. You can't stop me. You, you two, get these kids out of here. I'm gonna find Gemini. You kids are going down. You ain't gonna stop us. Come on, Shade, we have to beat these two. Ah, now we get a double battle. Burglar Dolph and Burglar Gaspard want to battle. Yeah, an Atomatrix, huh? Yeah, Golossus, you go deal with that one. I'll stop this thing from poisoning us. Ooh, nice. That was a good one. Good job, Golossus. Good job, AI. And Lunape leveled. Oh, do you have leftovers? Ew. Herb and Fanshee. Well, guess just get some ghosties. Poor Colossus isn't gonna be great though. Okay, rock slide, that works. Dark pulse again. Alright, there we go. This can't be real. Sorry, boss. Aw, oh, man. We better find the boss and warn him. Those guys are so annoying. Come on, Shade. We have to chase them. We can't let them catch Gemini. No. We must catch Gemini. Man, can you imagine if they just had a Pokemon game where, like, you actually can't catch the legendary. Somebody else just catches it before you. They don't let you use it. That'd be the ultimate troll. Oh, well, there's a thing. Huh, huh. Those kids are strong. We tried, but we couldn't beat them. Huh, huh. Sorry, boss. Again, you sure are useless. Get out of my way. Gemini, I will capture you and you will do as I say. Oh my god, is this Gemini? Catch a boss! No, you won't. Gemini, run. This man is going to capture you and force you to make jewels for him. You two again? You're getting on my nerves. You should learn to mind your own business. Maybe it's time I teach you a lesson. Gemini's is just there like, huh, you know, burglar lips. What a name. Uh, are you gonna Mega Evolve? Do you turn part dark type when you Mega Evolve? Yeah, well, guess we're not gonna find out. Earthquake? No, you can't know that. Well, we'll just slowly take him down. Marjorie's gonna level up too. And an Ella Stomp. Uh, we don't really have anything good against that, do we? Well, come on, Faye. Let's just Moonblast it. Because Moonblast works. Oh. What else you got? Uh, Tapa Blaze. Fang. Can deal with that. Okay. Got all the burglars out of the way. Time to go ca- oh, no, JK. I thought we were done. Sucker Punch. Now it's gonna be Dark type. Hmm. That's an interesting move. Yeah, still dark type. Now are we done? I thought he only had three Pokemon, but I guess he has four. Arr! Okay, now we can catch a Gemini. Pest, I'll still catch Gemini with this Master Ball! Uh, uh, what? What? Huh? Gemini? They teleported them away from here. Haha! <laughs> well, I guess that's one way of getting them to leave. Oh, we do get the Master Ball. That's fun. Gemini seems to like you. Maybe it liked the way you battled? 
Hey, Shade, look at the ground. That guy dropped his Master Ball. Oh. Well, the game gave us two Master Balls. That's actually really nice. Oh. Shade, I think Gemini wants to battle you. So cool. Shade, give it a battle. It might let you catch it. I was kind of hoping... Or, uh... No, sorry. My train of thought there. Um, no, it's neat that they let you have two Master Balls because then if you wanted to catch the two title legendaries with the Master Balls, then you could. Anyways, here we go. Gemini. Hello, you. You look really upset. Um, Fairy Rock? I mean, I did save, so... Jewel Flash, super effective. Rock? No, it can't be Rock. Okay, well that's super effective. Yeah, you must be Fairy Rock, eh? Okay. Uh, let's try that again. Hmm. Let's try Discharge, maybe? Just to see. Okay, yeah, normal effectiveness. What? Refractive? That sounds pretty neat. Do that one more time. Oh, perfect. And refractive's gonna hurt us, that's okay. Alright. Let's try catching Gemini. Although I'm sure this thing probably also has a catch rate of 3, which is gonna be lovely for us. We'll eventually get it. I wonder if this thing evolves, actually, come to think of it. Like, you know, there's nothing really stopping it from evolving. And that would be cool. Unless it's more in the vein of, like, a Manaphy or Victini or something, like, you know, just cute little myth Pokemon. Which I guess is cool, too. I guess all the legendaries don't have to look super, super cool. Gamma. It's not even rolling once, eh? Hmm. This could be a hard one again. Yeah. It's definitely a catcher at a three. We still have that one time ball if we need it. And thankfully we have a lot of Ultra Balls. Oh, I have a Fairy Gem on. Hmm. Alright, cool, cool. Good thing my whole team is weak to Fairy. <laughs> nah, just some of them. Gamma. You roll, like, at least once. That'd make me feel a little bit better. Just a tiny bit. Okay. Or just, you know, go from zero to a hundred right away. Alright. Thank you, game. Gemini, Rock Fairy, it is. Okay. Gemini collects any gems it sees. However, tales of it have it that it would still generously give out jewels to those who asked. Yeah, we're not going to nickname it. Alright, we got it. Wow, I can't believe Gemini chose you to be its trainer. That's so cool. I can see why you became the champion of Rokoto. Even mythical Pokemon want to travel with you. Well, the events here were intense. I need a break. Let's get out of here. Foosh. That was fun. I'm glad we stopped those guys from catching and using Gemini like that. Anyway, Shade, I'm going to head home to Orshore Town for a while. Maybe I'll visit Fall Rock Valley. See you later. We're gonna save. Because that was relatively painless. Um. Okay, now the real question is it's been a little bit of time since I've played. I don't quite remember where all we are headed. So we just did Jewel Mine. Could we go this way? Yeah, we could, couldn't we? So. Uh, let's do Sultry Town. 
Well, I guess we can't check out Gemini here, though. Oh, well. Uh, we'll heal. Or did the professor have a computer? He might have. We'll double check that just in case. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Uh, let's see here. Gemini. Refractive. Nature. Heightened speed. Lowered special defense. Refractive. Inflicts damage to the attacker on non-contact. Okay. So it's kind of like a rocky helmet, but the opposite. It's for special type moves. Flashes of Juex. Hmm. Yes, nice typo. Uh, jewel flash, 100, 100. Oh, that's a good rock type move. Thank goodness, because rock type unfortunately doesn't get a lot of love. The more the user's stats are raised, the greater the damage. Oh. Ho ho. Well, that's fun. Okay, where's our legends box? There it is. Alright. Well, let's go to that tropic jungle place because we haven't been there have we or is that the same forest that we were I don't know let's just go there it's sort of new content and we'll see what we can find slowly catching all the legends and myths Uh, oh, no, we do go this... no, we don't, right? This is just for extra stuff. Over... No, oh, yackles. Got some yackles here. No, oh, right, we went through all this. Caught healthy, uh... I remember now. Yeah, there's Kira. She's still there. Go up and around. Oh, dang. There's just snap bikes here, too. A lot of high-level Pokemon. I like it. Almost there. Over. All right, yeah, it was here and then we went left to the jewel mine. But instead, if we go to the right, we'll get some new stuff. And we want to see new stuff. That's the whole point of this. Is this the way to Amarillo? La 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 la. Well, at least you're in a good move. Good mood, sorry. Backpacker Minerva. Gigglu. Uh, what are you? You're rock ice, aren't you? You're dead is what you're, uh, you are. Fan sheet. Yeah, let's switch out. Get Vincent some more experience. Now that we're not encountering Pokemon every three steps. You're down. What else you got? Kelpula. Yeah, right, that thing. Grass water. Dream and dreams of Amarillo. Oh, I love this song, but that's the way to Tropic Jungle, of course. Yeah, we get to go to the jungle. Okay, anything there? No. There's a fighter. And a rock with nothing. You don't mess with the Fosto. Do not mess with people who refer to themselves in the third person. Says Shade.
Well, at least fighting types are going to be easy for us to take down. Thanks to Faye. Colossus. And what else you got? One of the bears, maybe? Maybe a Dinopian? Ah, Balker. Okay. Ooh. Dang, that thing's actually, you know, true to its name, bulky. No, oh, and it sent us out. Okay. That's fine. It's all good. Foster was angry. Out of Foster's way. Okay, that's where we need to go. Max revive, okay. What does the sign say? Entrance to Tropic Cave. No, oh, and it's dark. Why are all the caves dark? Why are caves inherently dark? Okay, well, new Pokemon, right? Or different Pokemon? Oh. Oh, you're the... Uh, I don't remember the name. Squibble or something? Fun... Fun... Fun germ? Fun germ? Cute whatever you are. Oh, you're the new champ, aren't you? Let's battle. First of all, with normal types. Wow. All right, these things are just defense tanks. Um, Mystic Wave, maybe? See if we can lower its defense. Or special defense, I mean. Well, I'm glad we have leftovers. Attack, okay, that's also a good one to lower. Yeah, let's just you're gonna glow it. Oh man, can you imagine if he just has like three Lazloths? That would be great. Carbon Nitro. Fire Ice. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that didn't do a lot of damage. Surprisingly, evasiveness. Uh, that's a lame one. Uh, that's Moonblast. What does Flare Up do? Does that power fire type moves maybe next turn? Kind of like charge? Probably. It's a good thing that, yeah, that's gonna do like nothing. Thanks for a thick fat. And a smackwa. Well, that one is easy. Faster than us, though. Rude. You're a real champ. Yes, I am. Okay. What else is in the cave? Oh, Kaboltas. Okay, lots of like snakes and spiders, which makes sense. Considering we're in a tropic cave. Oh, we got Sasquatch. The tropical variety. Yeah. Oh. You know, I kind of imagine the tropic jungle to be a lot more jungly. But cave is cool too, I guess. This liquos. See, also makes sense. Oh, item. How do I get you? Can I just go left of these stairs? Oh, also, we lost the music. Sorry, guys. Uh, no, we gotta go around to get that one. Okay. How do we go around there? This way, maybe? Yep, yeah, probably. Oh, hi, buddy. I can't find any ruins here, so what about a battle? Yeah, I don't have ground types. He has a ground type. Of course he does. Well, Zip, I am glad you're faster than this thing. 
bye bye. Uh, Meg Grizzly. Sure. Why not? Oof. That's not so good though. And Eclipser. It's got Cloud Nine, so. Alright then. No. Don't you dare. Man, that's a really unfortunate ability to have then if you're using Solar Beam. Because then you can never. Um. Like, you can't use Drought to your advantage? Wait, no, I want to get over there. Yeah, I probably do have to go up and over that bridge. Okay. We're going back. I want all those items. Oh, there's the Tiki Toko. I was going to call it a Freaky Tiki, but it's not a Freaky Tiki. There are Tikikis, though. Alright, now that we're back in a cave, it's another encounter every three steps place. Lovely. Yeah. Oh, we got Draco flies here, too. Okay. I'm getting lost in this cave already. And I'm tired of running into giant hairy apes. Thanks, game. Love it. Okay, can we go back across the water to get items? Oh, there's an item. Full restore. Okay, good. I don't know if I can land there. I think it's one block higher than what we're surfing at. Yeah. Hmm. What are you? Oh, Cryodros! I guess if you missed out on catching that thing the other time. Also, I wonder if we did have to go right to go get those items. If we did, we are gonna go back, I think, because I would like the items, yes? Yeah, kind of looks like it. Okay. Well, we're going back again. And I don't really feel like fighting this hiker either. Also, we lost our music. Hooray. I love the cave encounter raids in this game. Not. Huh. Come on, game. I got things to do. Can't sit around encountering stuff in caves all day. But I guess we're going to. Because shiny chances. One in a hundred. Kinda don't want to miss out on that. And there's a lot of cool Pokemon here that would have some really cool shinies. Just saying. Okay, what's below us? Is there anything below us here? Also, how can you not escape from this? Come on, Lunate. Come on. There we go. There is. There's an item. Okay. Ooh, that was some leg. Okay. Choice scarf. Encounter. Whoa, snail. Right. We have seen these. Okay. Surfboard. More snail. I don't know. Maybe this goes somewhere else. There are like two different spots, like main areas. Uh, item. Oh, 
I love how there's still like strength puzzles to get items, but because of the fact that there's no HMs in this game, it's kind of useless now. Like, you don't need that boulder there, because obviously we're going to go get the item anyhow. We have the strength gloves, but... It's kind of this weird thing where it's like an extra step to get an item you don't really need anymore. Okay, see, now we can go around. Okay. So we are going the proper way to get the items. Lunape's gonna freaking die here, yeah. Okay. Love it. Maybe if you weren't so slow, Lunape. Yeah, we'll heal him in a bit. Okay, Max survive. Worth it, I guess, especially since Lunape just fainted. And suspense. Our second item is suspense. Sacred. A okay, well. Alright, that one was worth it. Uh. Okay. Alright. There were a lot of items I was expecting, that was not one of them. This game sure knows how to surprise you with uh, items lying on the ground. <laughs> Shiny charm. <laughs> Man, every time, Cobolta's colors are just, like, Dunsparce colors, you know? Oh, that's not gonna help. It's like an unofficial Dunsparce. Also, at this rate, we're gonna have to use that Sacred Ash, because, dang, we can't run away from things. Wait, why is Lunate back to being our partner? Oh boy. I love it when the game glitches out like this. It's great. Yeah, okay, there we go. Just has to update that, yes, Lunape is in fact fainted. Okay, what was over this way? I wonder, can we even get to where we're going this way? Is it an item? It is an item, okay. And a snail. The guardian of the item is a giant moss snail to get a choice band. Oh, now we're definitely not getting away from this thing. Might be better off just dragon breathing it, honestly. Yeah, no, or not. Speed boost. Oh, and it's raising its special defense too, isn't it? So. Yeah, if this doesn't one shot it, we should just run. No, oh, but paralyzed it. We don't need the experience, though. Let's just run. Might be able to run now? Yeah. Encounter rates. I am sick of running through caves. Can we please not? Talk to the hiker. Round down. Please be the end of the cave. I'll gladly take a tropical jungle. Cave, not so much. Yeah, and there's a trainer. Okay, so we'll do our healing in a second because we're probably going to encounter something else before we get to that guy. Alright, let's see what we got. Um, ba -ba -ba bum. Lots of revives. And lots of full restores. Um, we'll save that though. 
Hyper potion. Get everybody healed back up. And a paralyze heal. Okay. This connection between Jewel Mine and Tropic Jungle is wonderful. Wait, what? They they connect? Is that how we're supposed to get to the area that had the strength boulder in Jewel Mine? Or does he mean like a geologic connection of some sort? Like same rocks or same energies or something? Oh, are you dark type? I thought you were ghost type. Steel type, I guess? Okay. Also, Lunape is gonna die again. This is lovely. Okay. Um. Mm -hmm. Is it, maybe? Because I think it's part flying. Yeah. Okay. And the band screen. We haven't seen that yet. No. Okay. You're spoopy looking. And it has hyper voice. Which makes sense. It just screams! All day. Every day. Just screams. No! Have you been in Jewel Mine? It said there's legendary Pokemon living there. You were just there, buddy. What a concept. Blow through all our hyper potions. Another ranger. Hey, do you explore this cave? Let's battle first. I mean, if we're being honest, I'm a little sick of caves, but yeah, I'm also trying to explore some caves here. It'd be great if you could just, you know, let me go. Let me do that. No, don't heal yourself with grassy terrain. Oh, now we can't escape. Okay. Beauty. Oh, we'll get a level up at least. Uh, Angelite. Might just be a little bit of a slow fight here. Wait, Angelite counts as being on the ground. Really? I guess? Sort of? I, I don't know. Oh, well, there goes the grass. Tablet. Psychic Steel, right? Hmm. I don't know if it needs raised attack though, honestly. I thought it was a special attacker. Might be a split though. Oh. Yeah, good thing we're kind of slow too. Ranger out. There's no way back if you enter Cascade Waterfall, so be careful. Oh, really? Seems a little unfortunate. Oh, 
go. This is where we've been, right? Yeah. This is where we saw the... Um, the little ice dragon fish thing. Okay, yeah, so we have been to Tropic Jungle. So there's just that cave, I guess? Hmm. Well, I'm gonna walk out of the jungle just in case there's somebody who wants to talk to me. Oh, and you know what? There's a shrine in this jungle, isn't there? I should probably keep an eye out for that. If I can remember where it is. I think there's a shrine, isn't there? I should probably consult my map about that. Uh, okay, map. What is it even going to tell us? Like if we go double check. Oh yeah, Volt Temple. Wanted house and stuff. Okay. Um. So well, that's what the doctor up there, I think. Let's just leave normally. And then if nobody wants to talk to us, let's go do another temple, I guess. Hmm. Okay, well let's fly somewhere. Yeah, what do we have here? So there's Tropic Cave, Cascade Waterfall, and Tropic Jungle. Okay, so we just went through Tropic Cave. Got it. Okay, so we did the Earth Temple. Now we just need to do Volt Temple. And we have an Electric type in our team right now. Because we need one of those too, in order to open up the secret pathway. Let's heal. Uh, we'll buy a couple more Ultra Balls as well. Just because we're here already. Just grab ten of them, I guess, because then we get a premier ball. Okay. Let's go catch something electric, I guess. Man, been a while since we've been here. Remember the good old days? That was back when we had a moon key. Which we now do not. Back when the day when back in the days when Bushu was a cute little dog thing, and not the laughing stock of the entire game. All right, and the lightning effects, which are pleasant. And more Bushus. And Dynamites, our old friends. I guess we have the Dinopian shiny now though, so... At least that's a little bit of retribution. Also, there's a waterfall that we can go into. Uh, but first... Put the Volt Stone on the pillar. The Volt Stone is reacting with the temple through the Electric-type Pokémon in your party. We have a legend to catch. Ooh. Looks like a fairy electric, if we're being honest here. Or maybe bug? Uh, Ethera. Fairy, right? Fairy electric. Mm. That's a neat Pokemon. Ice type of all things, wow. And you have a lot of varied moves. A lot of beam moves. I wonder if it has an ability that ups the power of beam moves. Because that would be really cool. Well, time to start hucking some Ultra Balls at you. And hope for the best. Yeah, it seems to know only beam moves. At least so far. Aurora Beam, Signal Beam, Solar Beam. Wow! Okay, that was what, like two throws? Dang, man. The game is pulling through today. Oh, it's just straight electric type. Ether Symbol Pokemon. Embodying the, 
embodying the element of ether, Ethera is said to hold the spark that can create life, and is able to allow species to communicate with each other. Well, that was easy. We're just gonna save right here. <laughs> uh, yeah, dang, okay. Uh, let's grab this waterfall while we're here. Aha! I knew it. Knew there had to be something here. And then we'll go up the waterfall, just to see. Take a peek. Look for some items. Boop. Oh, it's just a shortcut. Okay. Well, that's not so bad. That was a nice clip through that building, too. Okay. Yeah, these are just shortcuts and stuff, I think. But since we're here, may as well. Oh yeah, there's the doctor guy. Yeah, alright. Forget it. Uh, what's our next one, then? There's the landfill, cycling path, golden cave, fall rock cave, battle bridge. Okay, there's the core temple could do. It's probably the next one we should do. What would that be? Fire type, which we do have in our party. I guess we can go do that one, since we have the time now. Although at this rate we'll probably end up going over the hour, but that's okay. Amperate. Normal type moves become electric type moves. Raise defense, lowered attack. Okay, it had try attack. Oh, so this is now an electric type attack always? That's interesting that it knows so many beam moves then. Okay, uh, now high point. We have to go the. No, it wasn't this way. It's around. Oh, right, and then there's this route, which also has a high encounter, right? This is where the temple was, right? Uh, I'm gonna double check that before we get ourselves way too far in. Okay, yeah, core temple. And we lost our music. Womp womp. Don't even get nice music on this route while we run around. So, how's the silence treating everybody today? Good? Yeah? That's good to hear. Hope your days are going good. Hope you're all having fun. Hope you're still enjoying this series after 20-something odd episodes. Because I am. I love this game, actually. This is a good game. There's always little things that are going to bug me. You know, I gripe about the encounter rates and typos and all that, but overall, like, it's a good game. And if you have a way to play this game, I would definitely recommend doing that, because it's a good one. And there's a lot of Pokemon that you can use, so... you got lots of choices for what to train, how to play the game, how you're going to beat it. And there's a lot of post-game content. Or post-elite 4 content, I guess. Still haven't entirely figured out how to get Solaran and Lunaro. I'm assuming if I put the five stones in the temples, then maybe somehow that'll like, I don't know, open up a wormhole or something. <laughs> we can go visit them. Okay, here's the temple. That wasn't so bad. Put the core stone. Core stone is reacting with the temple through the fire type Pokemon in your party. Now we get to see the fire legend. Oh, it's a giant lion. Or tiger? Sabertooth tiger? 
Are we surprised? No. It... Tiger Core. It, it, it looks like a giant fang. Like, like our fang, you know? Huh. It's cool. Noble Roar. Attack harshly fell. Special attack harshly fell. Wow. That's a strong move. And that's gonna hurt. Uh, let's try a Dark Pulse. Yeah, I was gonna say, we don't get stab off of that, so... Okay, perfect. Oh, it's got recoil, though. Hmm. Well, this is gonna be a little more interesting now. This could be a bit of a harder fight. Or a harder capture, I guess. Yeah, it's got Intimidate, too. That's a nasty combo with Noble Roar. So oh, confused it though. Did I want that? I don't know. Uh, we'll do maybe a Dark Pulse. Because now I don't want to put its health too low. Oh, it's, this isn't good. Dark Pulse did more than I thought it was going to. Okay. Oh, and it knows Outrage, which means it has another way to confuse itself. Okay, this fight's probably going to require a lot of restarting. Yeah. Alright, we're part fairy type. Okay. Well, we get that going for us at least. So it can't confuse itself now. can still use Flare Blitz though. Yep. But luckily, because it doesn't do a lot, the recoil's not so bad. Okay, so Faye is actually not bad to have in this fight. It'll help us extend the time a little bit. Oh, I thought we were gonna catch it. <laughs> We've had, like, knock on wood. Uh, pretty decent luck with the legends today. Because if we catch this one, that's three legends. That's pretty good for an episode. What do I mean if we catch this one? We have to catch this one. I can't just end the episode while I'm mid-fight. That would just be mean. So what do we have after this? We have the Sea Temple. And then what's the last one? I don't remember what the last one was. Uh, but we're gonna have to bring a water type with us, I guess. And we also have to figure out how to get Pollution. Might be the landfill at night, honestly. That's about the best I can come up with. Crunch. Well, I'm sure this is riveting for everybody, so I'm just probably going to skip here to whenever we catch this thing. Hey, there it is. Okay. That was only two resets after when I last saw you guys, but the first reset didn't really count because I fainted it in two moves, so... Fire symbol Pokemon, fire type. Embodying the element of fire, Tiger Core is said to keep the lava and the mantle of the planet flowing, such that it will not freeze over. Alright. Caught Tiger Core. Woo! And yeah, that didn't take as many Ultra Balls either. Okay, it's gonna bug me. What's the last temple? Anyways. Ancient Pass. Oh, the Wind Temple. Okay, so we're only missing, what, one um, Pokemon? We need Water-type, but beyond that, like... 
We have flying type with Vincent. So that's pretty good, actually. Wonderful health. Okay, let's just check out our new Pokemon. Tigacore. Oops. No. Summary. Fire type. Uh, oh, it's called lowered attack. Lovely. Intimidate lowers the force. Attack stat. Yeah, Noble Roar is pretty cool. Okay. Um. Hmm. <clears throat> What water type should we grab? May as well be a shiny just to be swag points, you know. Um, maybe Jaws? Why don't we just grab Jaws? Swap you out. Throw you there for now. Okay. Um, ba -bum -bum -bum. It's gonna be Water Temple. We'll do zip. But that's pretty much going to do it for us today, guys. We're just over the one hour mark here. So thank you guys for joining me and we'll catch some more legendaries next week.